Hi, Moons. Hi, Arts Together, Preschoolers and Friends. Hello. Hi. This is Miss Nikki. I have two helpers with me tonight. I have Nicholas and Olivia Ray. And tonight we're going to read a story about what, what is? is. Sometimes there's a little monster that gets inside of our head. It makes us worry about things that we don't need to worry about. Like, what if it rains tomorrow during my picnic? What if I lose my lunchbox? What if I lose my tap shoes? Good. But should we worry about those things? Yeah. No. Has it happened yet? Uh-uh. Yeah. And if it happens, will you be okay? Yes. yes. All right, so tonight we are reading a book. What is the book called? What If Monster? By Jonathan James and the What If Monster. That's right, Jonathan James and the What If Monster by Michelle Nelson Schmidt. You have your little cuddlies. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Jonathan James and the What If Monster. Some What If Monsters like to hang out and fill up our heads with wooly and doubt. They are sneaky and quiet and quick as they blink. The words they whisper can change how we think. Jonathan, Jonathan James heard those words from Drip. And all those what ifs got stuck in his head. And there's Jonathan James and the what if monster. If it's yucky, <coughs> what if it's icky? Yeah. What if mom yells because you're too picky? What if it's what if it's a dog? What if it's scary? What if there's something?
she runs. What if she thinks you're not any fun? I almost forgot to show you the picture. Thank you, Nicholas. Welcome. Now, wait just a minute. I have something to say after hearing weather all through the day. I hear all your worries. I hear all your claims. But what if you're wrong? Jonathan James? What if I climb to the top of that tree and I never slip or skin up a knee? And what if I jump right into that pool and everyone thinks I look really cool and what if baseball is nothing but fun and i end up hitting a triple home run and what if my drawing goes up on the wall and everyone thinks it's the best one of all And what if I taste some of that food and it puts my mouth in a really good mood? Mm. And what if I run in a really big race and have a great time no matter what place? Do we always have to win? Does it matter if we win? No. no. And what if I sleep and have the best dream That monsters are sweeter than they all seem. And what if the chance I take in the end is just how I find my very best 